This ship sailed around Europe in the 15th century, carrying people and cargo like wine between Britain and other countries. But now it can be found right here in Newport, South Wales. No ship this old has ever been restored or displayed before, but experts here have been working hard to put it back together again, piece by piece. And Stefan, who works here, knows all about it. So what do you think life was like on the ship? Uh, I would have had a crew of about 30 or 40 people on board. Some of them would have been armed, just in case they were pirates. They weren't the only things living on the ship because they were rats and dogs aboard oh. as well. And we know, for example, that they play games on board, uh, board games. It's more than 30 metres long, weighs 25 tonnes, and there's more than 2,500 pieces to clean, restore and reassemble. For more than 500 years, it was buried deep underground and was discovered by accident back in 2002, here on the banks of the River Usk. The ship was removed by a team of archaeologists and lifted from the ground, timber by timber. What we've got on our hands is an enormous jigsaw puzzle. Yeah. <laughs> um, because when we found it in the river, there were no instructions. There was no picture of the ship on the front of the box to show us how it goes together. We've got to work out how these things fit together naturally. Yeah. And um, we, we've done that through a process of trial and error, like with these, and also making models. So how long do you think it's going to take to rebuild all of the timber here back into a ship? That's a very good question. Back in 2002, somebody said, oh, it'll take two years to do the complete process. We're already in our 21st year. Um, <laughs> but we are now feeling much more positive about it coming back together and that people at some point will be able to visit Newport and see the Newport medieval ship. Historians say this is one of the most interesting and important shipwrecks found in British waters in a generation. And I can definitely see why.